morning. So today, we it's Saturday, which, yay. Um, we're gonna go to Kohl's to return some stuff. I'm gonna go get Starbucks because pumpkin is out. So I just, you know, have to inhale it. Just inhale it. We're gonna go to Starbucks, Kohl's, we gotta go to Ulta because I'm out of um, heat protectant and I curl my hair like every day. Curl or straighten it because if I don't, it, it, I don't know, it's straight and then goes wavy. So we need to go to Ulta or Target because I wanna try something new but then I keep going back to this same one by AG, I believe. Walmart at some point because I remembered that I'm supposed to make a non-alcoholic mead for one of my friend's birthdays. His wife is throwing him a hobbit party, um, so that'll be fun. I'm not going to film that. Maybe I'll put some photos in the video or something, but I'm not, probably not going to film it. Um, but I get to wear my Renaissance outfit that I normally wear during Renaissance Fair, so I'm really excited to put that on tonight. Um, Yes, that's kind of what's going on. Oh, I might go to Hobby Lobby because, I'm sorry, I have to turn this down. Um, I went to my first book club meeting yesterday held by my sister-in-law and it was so much fun. Um, so, and she gave us like these uh, little notebooks that we can document our book club. So what we thought of the book, put photos, basically decorate it however we want. So. Um, I want to go to Hobby Lobby and maybe get some stickers or I want some dried flowers, which I know is probably cheaper to get on Amazon, so I don't know, we'll see. That's what we're doing today.
she got a Starbucks drink and she wanted it iced and they gave her a hot one and I just was like, you should correct them. <laughs> correct them, speak up. I'm that friend that if your order is wrong, I'll go back. But then the same can be said for me, I guess, is if my order is incorrect, sometimes I don't say anything and then my friends will, you know, swoop in like a mama bear. So my friend had her baby. Can't wait to meet her. That's what, that's what I was going to say. <laughs> so I got crumble cookie last night and I got this one called cinnamon toast crunch. It was so good. I told my husband, I was like, I should have gotten two of those because you're going to like that. Essentially it kind of tastes like a churro mixed with cinnamon toast crunch mixed with like a snickerdoodle appeal. Ugh, it was so good. I might do that today. But yeah, so I got the cinnamon toast crunch one, their peanut butter M&M one. That was pretty good too. And I thought I'd like that more than the cinnamon toast crunch, but I didn't. I like the cinnamon toast crunch the best. And then I got two chocolate chip cookies because at the book club, there were four of us. No, there were three of us total. And so I got some extra cookies so I could take some home to Kyle. Um, but yeah, and one of the girls hadn't tried crumble yet, so, and she liked it, so I was really happy I brought it, because I gotta try it once. I mean, I guess you don't have to, but you should, in my opinion. <laughs> At Hobby Lobby, I do want to look for stuff for my, my, uh, bookish journal, but I also want to get some stuff to decorate maybe my bookshelf and do a decorate with me for bookshelf decorate with me for bookshelf. Do I know how to talk? Uh, today and yesterday have been one of those days where I feel like I'm struggling to <clears throat> get my thoughts out. And I hate that. I don't know what that is a lack of. I don't think it's oxygen right now because those are, that's good. <gasps> oh my gosh, that's the other thing. I'm not, can you even see? got a little medical ID bracelet. Um, just because, I mean, I've always wanted one, but I feel like as I get older and I go to the gym alone, you know, it just might be beneficial to have. Um, so, and it doesn't look like a medical bracelet, you know what I mean? Which, you know, I love that. And yes, paramedics would like look in your phone and they'd probably call your, they call your um, ice contact, but this just gives them a little more info like, hey, pacemaker in belly, you know, call so-and-so, so, <clears throat> and it gives the type of heart problem on the bracelet too, so that is more info, the more info, the quicker, the better in my opinion, for anything. Um, <clears throat> yeah, this is a long rant. It's taking me forever to finish this. I'm gonna finish eating this. And we're gonna go to Hobby Lobby. And then, I need to Pinterest some non-alcoholic meats. Because I don't know what to make. I need to figure that out. Also, I might be meeting up with one of my girlfriends. Well, no, she's not by a spring. So we might go get um, some dessert at Balboa's, which if you've never been to Arizona, essentially they sell like fancy ice cream sandwiches or they do chocolate covered frozen bananas and like tons of toppings. It's just so good. I got this top from Kohl's. Not today, but I love it and it's cute. <laughs> It's actually one that I tried on and then I went back for, which have you ever been to Kohl's pickup? I don't know if I've ranted about this in other videos, but it feels so sketch. So like their pickup isn't monitored by anyone. You walk in, 
and they have this like um, screen. It's not even a screen. It's a piece of paper that says Cole's pickup, pull digital code, and then find your box and take the stuff. So literally, you pull up your number, you go into this little section, you pick up your own box, and you leave with it. But no one's monitoring it. Someone could just come up and steal someone's box. No one knows. Giving thieves thievery tips. I was leaving with my package, and I kept thinking, am I gonna get stopped? Like, this feels so wrong. No, nope. it just... And I texted a group of my friends and I was like, has anyone done Cole's pickup? And they're like, yeah, it feels so wrong, right? I was like, yeah, yeah, it does. I'll see you at Hobby Lobby. Bye. I need to find some bookish themed stickers, but I'm not having any luck. But I did find a whole bunch of floral. It's on clearance, like dried florals, that I'm probably gonna put on my um, notebook. So I'll show you those when I get home. and off to go home. All right, we are back home with our Hobby Lobby. So, at the book club yesterday, Kelsey gave us these notebooks. Aren't they cute? She had a whole bunch of fall colors. And we got bookmark, bookmarks. Thank you. Okay. So my idea is I want to cover the front with a whole bunch of flowers. So I got, and I hit a good little jackpot because um, everything was practically on clearance. So, and I don't mean like their discount, I mean clearance. So I got these, I got these. Those. These ones were the 40% off, so these weren't clearance. I actually kind of forgot that I bought these. Um, but it's like a little camera and travel. More florals. And that's the end of the, no, there's one more. No, two more. This one's by far my favorite. And then this one has sparkles on it. And then my friend, Nicole, gave me a happy planner. Um, and I really wanna get back into just journaling and maybe tracking the expenses a bit better um so i have this i already have this but i saw some inserts that intrigued me a bit more that i could put in there so i got this one that has your expenses you see that oh no i just really like that and i like that it's skinny too it doesn't take up the whole page um, and then I got a debt payoff tracker, which I, I get the irony. I, you don't even have to say it. Debt tracker, and then you're buying debt trackers, but like, I don't have to put in the work to write it down as much. So it says due date, balance, amount paid, remaining balance. It also, that's neat. It also has like username, password, goal, payoff date. Um, and these were 40% off. So I think it was about $4. Or 
which by the way, I estimated all of this before I bought it and I was like pretty much on point with it. Cause you know that tax throws you off and you gotta just add like four or five bucks to it or more like eight. I don't know, I add tax for every little thing so I'll just round it up. Um, this was 50% off, or 50% off. This was only 50 cents. Figured I could use it to, with the book go. Maybe I'll like add a little tie to close it. That would be cute. Yeah, that's my Hobby Lobby haul. Um, I didn't go to Ulta. I just, I don't know, I wanted to get home. Uh, to relax a little bit. Yeah, hope you enjoyed the Hobby Lobby haul. Sunday. Um, so we went to the party. I didn't get any photos. We were run running so behind so I didn't um, get any photos yesterday but um, the hostess did so um, those will be nice to look back on. Um, I finished my book journal and I think it turned out really cute. You guys probably saw in the um, Time lapse. I was trying to use this that didn't work. I ended up switching to a glue gun. Um, but here is the finished product. I think it's cute. It's just something fun. So, yep. Uh, anyways, I'm going to end the vlog here. Um, Please like this video and subscribe if you so desire, if you like this content. Um, and yeah, have a great day. Bye.